This recipe is brought to you by RecipeLion.com. These cinnamon rolls are an awesome treat on a crisp fall morning. Peel one large potato, cut it into chunks and boil them until soft. In a small bowl, measure out two cups of the potato water and let it cool to 110 to 115 degrees. At the correct temperature, add the yeast to the potato water and whisk until it dissolves. Add two tablespoons of sugar to the yeast and whisk that to dissolve. Let the yeast work for 10 minutes. In a large mixing bowl, add one cup of the mashed potato, two beaten eggs, the non-fat dry milk, vanilla, three quarter cup of melted butter, three quarter cup of sugar, and the salt. Mix these just enough to incorporate them. When the yeast is ready, add it to the potato mixture. Begin adding eight to eight and a half cups of flour, one cup at a time, until a nice dough forms. Scrape the dough onto a floured surface and knead until it's elastic and shiny. Put the dough in a large greased bowl and let it rise for two hours until doubled in size. Punch it down and let it rest for 10 minutes. In a small bowl, combine the brown sugar, granulated sugar, chopped pecans, and cinnamon. On a floured surface, roll the dough out into a very large rectangle, about one quarter inch thick. Melt the stick of butter and spread this over the surface of the dough. Spread the filling over the dough, keeping one half inch away from the edges. Starting at the longest side, roll the dough jelly roll style. With a sharp knife, cut it into 12 equal pieces. Carefully move them to a prepared pan and leave enough room for the rolls to expand. Cover them and let them rise until doubled in size. This is where you can place the covered rolls in your refrigerator and let them rise slowly overnight. Let the rolls come to room temperature and preheat the oven to 350 degrees. Bake for 25 to 30 minutes or until they're golden brown on top. To make the frosting, beat one half stick of softened butter until it's smooth and creamy. Add three cups of powdered sugar, one half teaspoon of vanilla, one quarter teaspoon of cinnamon, and a pinch of salt. Begin stirring in four tablespoons of heavy cream, adding more or less to get it to the right consistency. Frost the rolls, and be sure to pick your favorite one before someone else gets it. Thank you to RecipeLion.com for sponsoring this video. Please subscribe to the channel to get more great recipes.